Hello there and welcome to this video. So one of the frustrations sometimes when using LSPDFR or any mods with games like Grand Theft Auto 5 is that Rage plugin hook that we use um, sometimes seems to crash and you know in game it will give you a message where it's like LSPDFR plugin has failed to load or has crashed and kick you out of the game basically to leave you back in some kind of like normal Grand Theft Auto land. So there is a way to find out exactly what's causing the crashes, because obviously if you've got multiple mods installed, which most people have, then it can be quite hard to find out what is causing the crash. So if you go to your main Grand Theft Auto 5 folder, in my case it's on the hard drive, program files, Rockstar Games, Grand Theft Auto 5, if you scroll down, there should be a folder that's called Logs with a capital L. Um, and uh, this folder here is what is used by Rage Plugin Hook, as you can see there. There's a log created every time you press, um, every time you play the game. And essentially, it logs all the activity in here from the console. So, you know, in game, when you press F4 and it shows you the Rage Plugin Hook console, well, it also saves the files that you can go back later and check the log so if we check this latest log if something's crashed presumably it's crashed towards the end of the file so it started the new log up there at that time and if we go to the scroll bar over here and we scroll all the way down if we've quit because something's crashed because it obviously is logging everything it will actually be right down near the bottom so we've got there false termination lspdfr is shut down blah blah, blah. oops there was an error so if we go up a little bit, you're looking for a section which looks something like this, unhandled exception, which means there's an error. That hasn't been handled in a graceful way, so there's no error message being shown up, it can't carry on. Uh, some of it doesn't really tell us a lot, so unnamed thread, great. Type rage exceptions, invalid handleable exception. So basically, something's gone wrong. But the bit that you want to look, out to look at to find out what's gone wrong is this one where it says inner exceptions. So if we look there and we look at the stack trace below it, we can see here the error that caused the game to crash on us last time at the end of Shift 17 in our video was Maniac Callout, which is one of our callout packs. So something happened with the weapon file, which kind of makes sense because the game crashed on us at the point where a callout was spawning, basically. So that makes sense for why that error relates to that crash. So the first thing we can do here then is investigate that further. Now, it could just be a one-off. And if it's a one-off, fair enough. If you play it time and again afterwards and it works out fine, uh, then you can keep it on. If consistently you're seeing the same plugins here causing the crashes, then obviously it's a good idea to remove it. This can be if it's still an available mod, but for example, it's not been updated for the latest version of LSPDFR, which is currently 0.4.9 or update for the latest version of Grand Theft Auto, because basically every time both those updates happen, at least the plugins need to be checked, but certainly if they get way out of date, then that can be a cause of issues. And ultimately it can be conflicting with some of the other mods you have, so it might be a specific combination of mods. But certainly in this case, if this error keeps on happening for us, if we remove Maniac Callout, we will remove the problem. So, Hope that helps with trying to diagnose your Rage plugin hook errors. If you have any errors that you need help with, feel free to post them in the comments and we will try to help you out and have a look into it for you. Um, if you have enjoyed the video and it has helped you, don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more tech tutorials and we shall see you again shortly. Bye!